Welcome back everybody. So today, yes, we're back on Firestick updates again, and this is huge, guys. Something we've been waiting for for ages. I know many of you put off updating your Firesticks, and I'm going to tell you why this one is important to get fully updated today to date. Okay, this is a great addition. We've wanted this back in ages. One of the most annoying things on the latest versions of Firesticks. One of the most reasons why people don't update their Firesticks, and they finally fixed it. Brilliant. Before we do that, if you can, do hit that subscribe button. We have just hit 400,000 subscribers. 400,000. So thank you to all of you guys. Let me know in the comments how long ago you think you subscribed, if you can. And we're going to crack right on with this video. So, Fire Sticks. What's been the most annoying thing about apps on your Fire Stick for the last 12 months? I'll tell you what's been annoying. You go into your apps, my apps... And you have apps with grey icons and you have no idea what they are. Okay, so no matter what apps it is, you have a grey icon, you can't see what they are. We used to have to do crazy little fixes um, to get around seeing what they were and nothing was very good. And they were grey. Okay, what you may have noticed as me scrolling through all of my apps there, some official, some probably unofficial, some from God knows where, not one of them is a grey icon anymore. Um, if you don't know what I mean, here is what I mean about the grey icons. Um, a lot of apps which weren't recognised suddenly by Amazon, they used to be, and they weren't. Something like the Wolf Launcher here, this used to be just a grey icon, you'd have no idea what it was. But that's right, since the latest update, you can now update your Fire Stick and all the icons for all the apps are working again. Yeah, yes, 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 amazing, okay, but... As always, we tell you at times not to update your Fire Sticks. Um, probably like I told a couple of days ago, we had a video. Uh, where's my videos? Do not update your Fire Stick until you do this. So that one was telling you not to update something until you do a certain step. But that was all because people were losing their developer options. So if you update fully, like I'm going to tell you to do now, again, it's your choice if you want to. You may need to watch my video from yesterday, which I'll link underneath as well, about getting your developer options back if they disappear. Okay, so to fully update your Fire Stick, what we need to do now is go from your home screen. You go all the way across to your settings. Go to My Fire TV, About, and either Install Update or Check for Updates, okay? I'm going to click Install Update. As of today, the update isn't breaking anything else. Some people are losing developer options, but there is a way to get it back, which we can show you in a second again. And all your grey icons will be back. Yes. So this is what it will do during an update. This is a prime time for you to comment underneath for me. Give me that thumbs up. Give me that share. We've been after this feature back for ages, and it's going to be so much better, especially for some of the install guides we do in the future. Some of the guides where we show you how to install apps from third parties, for, from other places, and you don't know what those apps are because the icons are gone. Brilliant. So, at any point, if you guys have lost your developer options here, you go to About, and you just click on the name here of the Fire TV Stick 4K Max, or whichever version yours is, click on it seven times, and you'll see at the bottom you are now a developer. But that's on the other video if you need it. Brilliant. So all icons are back. As a real quick video tonight, um, we're going to quickly just pop over to my site here. So if you have any issues with your update, follow this video here, the do not update one, and it will show you what you needed to do before you update, but it's fine. Get it up to date. Again, this is my opinion. I know many of you like to block updates. I know many of you like to block updates, so that's your choice as well, folks, okay? Your choice, but I thought I'd get you this video out tonight quickly so you all know your icons are back if you get fully updated. This is working on the 4K Max. This is working on the 4K. Um, please let me know your product underneath if it doesn't work. And we'll have a look into that as well for you. Anybody with any questions, do feel free to follow my Twitch account. And um, We're doing live streams on there with help guides. So literally we're going to go live. Anyone with any questions about your Fire Stick or your streaming, we're going to show you live how to fix it or to do things. That's the plan. Um, the schedule will be up over the next few days. We might be live while this video is out, depending on when you're watching it. So do, again, my Twitch is underneath. And a quick word from one of our partners, which allow us to do these videos for you. 
IP Vanish VPN is also linked underneath. This is a partner of ours for anybody who needs a VPN on their device, whether it's on your Fire Stick, your mobile phone, your PC, anything like that. IP Vanish is great for your online safety, uh, for your connections, your internet privacy, um, advanced encryption, secure access, all there for you, all safe. Brilliant. That's linked underneath as well. Um, we don't have any donations or anything like that. We don't have any membership schemes. We don't have any Patreon. So if you use an affiliated link, it does help support the channel, which allows us to do some big giveaways, which hopefully we will be covering for our 400,000 subscribers as well. Brilliant. So I've been Doc Squiffy. This is the Doc Squiffy channel. A quick update there on those grey icons, and I'll see you soon.